5 a.m. start. Got a 500 meter climb out of the valley. But we're two and a half hours into the day already. This our bonus trek yesterday. Try to stay positive. How are you feeling today, Jordash? Well, they're a little sore. Beautiful view down the valley this morning. And we are imagining ourselves feeling fresh. Bundled up, it's gotten really chilly. Day four, we're getting there. 10 o'clock, and about two hours, two and a half hours away from lunch. We're out of the rain and the fog, and uh, I think we can see lunch off in the distance. It's an overcast day, it's actually kind of nice for walking. And down there in the valley is lunch. I was wrong. That's not our lunch stop. One more hour. Lunch is going to taste that much better. Positive spin. Just positive spin. Coming off the mountain and out of the fog, we left Italy and we entered Switzerland. Very Switzerland-esque. 12.37. And we've arrived. It's a patio in the distance. Had our lunch. It's gotten hot. And we're hitting the road. The afternoon of day four, and we've just begun stage eight. There are 11 different stages, usually done one stage per day. And stage eight is the easiest stage, so we've read. So we're looking forward to a four hour jaunt and we'll get into our refuge around 6.30. About halfway done the afternoon. Just realized we're 30 minutes ahead of schedule. Road walk. We're enjoying the view of the valley and about 30 minutes left, resting our weary bones here. 30 minutes. Whew. Today's been a slog. Really hoping that our estimate was accurate. Checked in, seven o'clock, dinner is being served here and here are rooms. Awesome. How are they awesome, you may ask? Well, it's not a bunk bed, point number one. And no footboard, point number two. Two-point system. <laughs>